Hello everybody and welcome back to Final Fantasy Fridays and we are going to continue on with Final Fantasy 15 Pocket Edition. We just got started here on Chapter 3. So Noctis and the gang are running around the city. Uh, it's been a week. I don't even know what I was doing. Right, we got to go up here. Okay, so we can just keep going left. Yep. We're going to meet Iris. Iris? Iris? I forget. Um, okay. <laughs> How many times are you going to change? Uh, the forever question, isn't it? All right. Gladdy! Iris. I think I have my volume turned up very well. Oh, yeah, I do, apparently. Hopefully that's coming through okay on the stream. Uh, I'm recording this while uh, not really having the ability to test it. So my MacBook Pro is unfortunately in the out of commission. <laughs> um, so I'm actually waiting on a new MacBook Pro under the warranty, or I'm going to have to get a refund and buy another one. So I might be out of a Mac for a while. Um, so we're doing our best. I'm kind of uh, experimenting with the audio here um, as I record Final Fantasy XV Pocket Edition. So... Crew is going to carry on here, meeting Iris and what are we going to discuss? So basically this is a camping scene, but we're camping in style. I mean, Noctis is royalty after all. Although I'm pretty sure in the in the full version of the game on console and PC, you could actually choose what dishes you ate at your campsites. So getting close. Getting well, let's say close. We're getting closer to level 14. I don't think we got any new AP. Um, pretty sure we were going to hold what we had. Whoops, sorry about that timer. Forgot I had that set. Sure, let's go see the sights. Head to the market. Oh my goodness, this is going to be... I was going to say, if we have to walk all the way there, this is going to be a very, very slow-paced episode, y'all. I think we explored all this the last time I came through. Sure, act interested. Always act interested in retail therapy, even if you're not. There's plenty of times that the significant others act interested in things that they are not <laughs> for your benefit. So just, just be polite when you're out with the with the crew. Okay, great. Let's go see the power plant. Wherever that is, where's the power plant? Uh, okay, north. All right, let's go north. The 
Stalem. I forgot what city we were in. I'm glad she said that. Really? Only women work there? Huh. Wait. Why? <laughs> Hold on, I'm a little concerned. Why are only the women doing work? I mean, that is cool. Like, don't misunderstand. I just don't know why. Hopefully they'll tell us it's why it's only women working at the power plant. Uh, oh, we gotta go all the way back south, huh? Okay then. Going to check out, what is it, the disc? The breeze. I do wonder if, like, some a big, like, crystalline structure like that. Hey, look at that. Um, if a big crystalline structure like that would, in fact, like, have like some sort of weird effect on the smell, like a sea or an ocean does. Pegler Outlook. Uh oh. No, we're we're getting married to Luna Freya. Knocked us off the market, my my good lady. Off to the market. I really do think Square Enix did a great job with this with this pocket edition. It's the the camera work, the transitions, like you move around the town, are really nice, smooth, fluid. It's not like there's loading screens and stuff. It's great. Let's make light of it. I don't disagree, but just, you know. <laughs> Babysitting. <laughs> oh, that's right. I got my achievements working again. Yay. for the inventory. Find the cave behind a waterfall. All right, where do we need to go? So there's a food vendor. There's a couple food vendors. What? Am I understanding that right? Oh, wait. There's an item. Whack. <laughs> ah, it's not food. It's, it's ingredients. Yeah, okay. So we've got to hit... Okay, there's a side quest right here. We also, okay, all right, I see what's going on. All right, cool. Let's do this. down the cactuars for him okay um, I guess it means we're going south we're gonna hit this other recipe and then we're gonna go out to the uh... wait what oh boy killer tomato all right Two ingredients obtained. Da, 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 da. Easy 500 XP. Okay, let's go check this. The little observation platform here. Scraps of mystery number one. Let's see where it takes us. So where would the treasure map be? Scraps of mystery. So it's got to be near 
Look for a lion statue, huh? Near the center of town, maybe? No. Maybe not. Hey, look, there's a cactuar. Hooray! Oh, okay. It's by a cart. I gotcha, I gotcha. Alright. I think I know where this is. It's down in the main plaza. Plaza, plaza. Oh, wait, or it's right there. It's right there. Click the thing. Yep. Where's the next one? Hmm. I'm gonna keep saying this is down in the main plaza until one of them is eventually down in the main plaza. <laughs> uh, I don't think so. Not there. It's gonna be in the market then. Do you think? Umbrella with tables. Hmm. There's tables around here, but no umbrella. So many stalls. That's just food. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I think we should. Uh, I guess we should keep going around. Go, walk. Come on, knocked. You can do it. Yep, look at this. Another cactuar. Oh, I have crates to destroy. As we've already established, Noct is the box destroyer. Hmm. -hmm. Okay. So that has an umbrella, and that has an umbrella. So there's a food cart, one of which is empty, next to some trash cans and a traffic cone. So is that by the road? It's going to be my guess, so it's out by the road. Here, stuck on that little trash bag. Okay, as far as we can go. There's a, so here's some traffic cones. No, we're not leaving yet. You want us to leave, I know, but we're not leaving yet. Let's see. Ah, here we are. This is this is the place. For sure. How many more indeed? Oh, hang on. Okay. All right. A bench next to one of the big flower pots. Or the smaller flower pot to its right. So, yeah, see, told you, main plaza, eventually. <laughs> the Grand Chamberlain, all right. Hidden treasure in Lestalem. That was only worth 200. We found two pieces of food and got 500, but running all over town for three lost items and we get 200. Okay. Alright, 
now we gotta find the cactuar. Where are the remaining cactuar trophies? I wonder if it's one of these things where they do not appear. Ah, see, there's one right there. If they appear in like a certain order, so the f the fourth one doesn't appear until you've got the third one. The third one wasn't there until we had the second, and so on and so forth. Hmm. Can we go in? We cannot go in. nothing over there that would have been something if that the boy's a uh, statue that he showed us the first cactuar he showed us was actually one of the ones we have to find that would have been something huh I should have hit something back here it's kind of out of the way There we are. Four. All right, now where's the fifth one? Ah, I'm getting bullied. <laughs> I'm just griefed out of the way by these people. I'm daggone royalty. You can't do that to me. Well, I dare say, sir, I'm royalty. You can't do that to me. That's not a, that's not a British accent in the least. I don't know what accent that is to work on my like arrogant Englishman accent if I'm going to do that so we already grabbed that one from right there it's got to be someplace kind of obvious right I mean they're all kind of obvious but Okay, so we've got one that was up here in this corner by the shop, one that was in that alley, one from the market, one from the plaza. The only other place is down by the lookout, the little observatory ring. The disc is the one old man called it. There it is, right there, in the bushes. Yep. It's always in the bush, isn't it? And that only got us 400. <laughs> the experience scaling on this is uh, something else. <laughs> All right, so I guess we're done with that, so we don't actually have to go and do any returns. We just go get it and move on. Yes. The Grayshire Glacial Grotto. Hey, look, we got five AP for it. Hard to be upset about that. Unlockability. Oh, we got a lot more than five. <laughs> okay. 17 to 36. Two accessories, which would be beneficial. I think the idea I originally had was to keep leveling up the allies, but then there were these their abilities it seemed like they would be such good ones to have last hit upward slash sword combo man tough call guys tough call boost damage inflicted by an elemental weakness given how infrequently we have elemental stuff then may or may not be worth it, but it's, you know if we typically can at least right now if we can only use it once or twice, then each time we use it, if we could hit big, that would make a first and last hit. Sword of the Wise. So ten, twenty, forty. Ooh, we need four more. 
Okay, let's do let's do this one. We'll do this one. So we're not using at least I'm not so far, I'm not using a lot of the uh the sword of the wise stuff. Boost damage, yeah. Okay, great. Proceed to the glacial grotto. Grotto. Grotto? <laughs> what does the water ball fall say? Well, we don't really have much options here, do we? Can't really run down the road and can't really explore anywhere. So does Final Fantasy XV Pocket Edition get the same grief that Final Fantasy XIII does for being too much like a corridor? Is their hair all frosted? <laughs> oh no. Dodge. Ooh. I have to work on my parrying, that's for sure. Is dude like stealing my health? Is that what's going on here? Party, 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 party. Where was it? Oh uh, no, I don't want to do that. Don't want to use my mega potion yet, not at least. Okay, no, I thought there was a the path down there that I missed. Apparently not. Hey, look at that. Whee! Oh, we can get ice element as well. Nice. Okay, split path here to the right and the left. The right's the more direct route. Oh, wait, no. Left is more direct. I was looking. I thought I was somewhere else. All right, we need to go right. That's going to loop us around. There was that uh, little ice cliff that we passed there. Cool, when one of your allies is like doing their thing, if you try to get attacked, the game will just automatically dodge for you. Yeah, he's sucking health from me. That guy. Look at this. Look at this jerk.
and hop down. Oh, okay. Ah, oh, there is an item up there. Oh, man. I was not paying attention. I wonder if I use my ice element, if it'll automatically switch me back to fire, or if I've completely lost my fire element because I picked up that ice element. All right, I'm glad we went all. <laughs> I'm glad we went through that twice for an earth gemstone. Come on, slide down it one more time, not. Come on. Really? Okay. Is that just a dead end? It doesn't look like it's a dead end. Why can't I get over there? Huh. Maybe we can only come from the other direction, or do I have to hit it? Do I have to hit it? Yeah, that's what it is. Okay. Ice cave full of icy imps, I guess. If I may, don't ask. <laughs> yep, we're lost. <laughs> don't answer. <laughs> we fought in the last dungeon oof that was impressive dodge no oh, no just got a little minions out. Oh, uh oh, run, 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 run! What are you doing? Run! Ugh. Okay, hold on. We gotta. We gotta heal up the crew here. Phoenix down. On. Okay. I can't get a hit in edgewise here because I'm getting electrocuted. Ugh. Let's go help Prompto. Let's kill this weakest tarantula first. Crew's doing good on health. Oh, dodge. Woo. Kill her, kill her, kill her! Ooh, there we go. Okay, this one here, this battle axe thing is definitely your crowd control. If you need to clear a room quick. This item here. Doesn't do as much damage as the Cactuar sword, but 
it's it's fast hitting. Here's there. Yeah, they are imps, okay. crew let's get back on the road here before we freeze our royal backsides off is Nox's hair getting wider is it like more and more frozen as we go on through this terrible place <laughs> terribly cold Uh, of course, fight. Boom! <laughs> Alright, let's see, where are we going? So let's try to stay in this main area because I know that there's an item down here. So we'll stay in this main area and then we'll come up across this path in the middle and then we'll go around. <laughs> He's trying to say eeny meeny miny mo. Here we go, we go for a little slide. We to Winter Wonderland. Oh, I could have been breaking these the whole time. Who knows what kind of good items I've missed out on? Like a Phoenix down. Oh wait, there's two other items. And a couple potions. So, need to go north. Oh, that's a nice slide as well. So, it looks like we are going. Where are we going? Ah, here we are. And we are going to go, yep, straight up this way. Did he say I should have brought my anti-slip shoes? Okay, attack now. <laughs> Forty-eight damage. Uh, dodge. Okay. Back to the spear. What I like about the spears is just so it's so rapid fire. The hit rate on it's just super high. Cross through here. Boy, this is a long cave. 
say for 20 bucks you're getting your money's worth okay let's do this so basically go into a limit break just to not kill but two of these things okay I'm gonna hop up here let the team take care of those flans nope nope kill the imp get rid of the fire support Okay, let's check back here, make sure there's not something good in this corner. There's not. Nothing up there either. Okay. Smash those crystals. That's something good. A high potion and a potion are always good. Ooh, what's that over there? Something gold and shiny. A potpourri. All right, what does that do for us? A sweet spirit enhances spirits slightly. I think that's a. I don't know. Is that a is that a me item or is that a Ignis item? Enhances strength. I feel like this is a Noctis item because what spirit? Yeah, he's definitely got though. That's spirit, isn't it? The starburst next to the 90. Okay, so we need to do. Yeah, let's keep them. Yeah, this is what we need to do. For sure. For sure. Soldier's anklet. Vitality. That's. Vitality slightly. Yep. That's a gladio thing. Vitality slightly. Strength slightly. Yeah, let's do. Is he's got the garnet bracelet? Oh, so there's only, there's some items that are only available for knocked. Accessory exclusively for knocked. Okay, increases damage done with teammate techniques. Okay, well that's kind of important, huh? Bronze bangle, garnet bracelet. Yeah, let's do that. So two seventy three, five thirty eight, two oh one, two fifty five. I'm like the second weakest in the party. <laughs> second strongest. Okay. There's just such a... Gladio's damage is just so high. Woo. I generally operate on the theory when it comes to RPGs. Whatever the best stat is of any character, you just dump everything you can into that stat to just exacerbate what's already great about them, you know? Uh, I don't know. I don't know if anybody's played the uh, Legend of Heroes games, but that seems to be a very that seems to be the the way to do it in those games. Potion on Noct real quick. Paying attention to my health now, hmm? I'm learning. Don't sound too surprised when I say I'm learning, okay? I know, I'm in chapter three, I should know this already. So wait, okay, so we can't come from the other direction. It just looks like we can.
and we are near the end. More thunder. Don't fall to your death or anything, knocked. That would be unfortunate for royalty such as you. And here is our tomb and another boss. Whoa, what is that thing? The Mind Flayer. That's probably not promising, huh? Get him! Dawn Hammer. Dawn Hammer! Oh. Really curious how much health this thing has. No, no, get out of the way. Oh, no, heal. Where's Phoenix down? Phoenix down. Combo tap. Okay. I feel like that was a new one. Is that, am I crazy? Is that a new one? Uh, what am I confused? Am I like dazed? Is that what it is? I can't do anything. Oh boy. That thing has so much health left. How is that? Combo! Combo! Get the Dawn Hammer on him. Potion on knocked and you and you double up on you. Okay. Ah. No, no, no. Ooh, high potion. Ooh. Dodge. Combo. Dang it. I'm not very good about these combo taps. Oof. Phoenix down. Potion. Wow, this thing has so much health. What a joke. Okay, I gotta stay out of its way. Maybe the goal is just to have it chase me and then get my teammates up behind it, you know? Where they can do damage to it. I was about to say, isn't it like it's... Okay, I thought its health was like nearly full a minute ago, and now I was like, wait, why is it so far low now? All right, here we go. Here we go. Yes. And what is this? Another sword? Like a... Okay, it's like... It looks like a Batleth. <laughs> like, if you were a primitive Klingon designing a Batleth, this is what it would look like. Okay, Swords of the Wanderer. Got it. Alright, a king was quick like... A king was quick like... Like the wind and went where no man has gone before. See? Where no man has gone before. <laughs> These were his blades. <laughs> <laughs> Apart, they rain fury. Together, they deliver thundering blows. So 
So damage would be down, HP would be down, but MP would be up. I don't think I want to. I don't think I want to equip that. I think we all owe him a thanks. You're not wrong. Still, having another weapon over the royal arms is not a bad thing. Uh oh. Have another sinus headache. Stand by. I hope if we have to fight Titan, it's going to be a pretty epic fight. Now, I've been playing Final Fantasy 16, so maybe my expectations are a little too grandiose, but I hope it's not I hope it's not bad. Got the team to level 15. Oh, almost to level 16. Almost. Boost parry damage. I'm not, I'm not even very good at parrying, so I'm not going to bother with that one. Close that for now. All right. Looks like we are done with this little tomb trial. This little tomb raid that we've gone on. Yep. Oh. Back at the uh, the glamping site here. Magic boost, MP boost, MP region boost. So it looks like they just assume that you're gonna swap between every one of the 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 royal arms that you get as you get them. So, because these are all MP boosting, right? And magic focused, which the Sword of the Wanderer seems to lean into. So, been at this for about 50 minutes 48 minutes and some change here so I think I'm going to call it here everybody because we have to prepare for tonight's stream Final Fantasy 8 carrying on with that and uh, so let's go to our settings let's look at the achievements nice Dock blocked, nice. And sync to the cloud, yes. Ah, the sync failed again. Oh well, it's saving. All right, that's great, still. All right, game saved right here, y'all. Next time we will, uh, we will carry on and we'll look at the disc. I suspect we're about to fight Titan. I just got that just got that feeling. So I don't wanna spend, you know, another 10, 15, 20 minutes doing that when uh, I have other things that need to get done before the stream. So all of you have a great Friday morning and I look forward to seeing you tonight for Final Fantasy VIII, our next part in Final Fantasy VIII, and where we will carry on the adventure. So thank you everyone. Have a good day. Bye-bye now.